Merry Christmas. Check this out. Broadcasting live worldwide. Hi, Daddy. Ariel, can you say have faith? Yeah, I can. On June 16th, 2018, a show designed for you, The Daily Commuter, went live. A weekly show all about faith. A show with motivational topics, inspirational stories, and personal testimony set out to change the world. Have faith, let it begin. (laughs) One day you'll say it. (laughs) Can you say have faith, let it begin? (laughs) Yeah. Yeah. Daddy loves you. Daddy loves you. Welcome to Have Faith. Let it begin. Here's your host, Angel Santana. Ariel, can you say have faith? Let it begin. Let it begin? Let it begin. Say have faith. Let it begin. Let it begin. No, no. No? No? Okay. Hello, everyone. What a fitting song to start a Friday edition of Have Faith, Let It Begin. Merry Christmas to everyone. Happy holidays. Happy Hanukkah, December 10th, 2021. This is Angel. This is Have Faith, Let It Begin. And I thought it was funny to put this in the background because this morning had a little bit of an accident uh, while trying to give my dog Cody his pill. Uh, he accidentally went a little bit too far and it bit my finger. <laughs> Yeah, he didn't mean it. I just, you know, listen, there's only one way to put pills uh, for a dog to eat. I put it in a little stretch of ham. Um, We have a saying that we tell him, take nice. And the first pill was no problem. I said, take nice. And he he opens up nicely and he just grabs it. Well, I think he just loved that piece of ham so much that when I told him to take nice the second time, not only did he take nice, he took a nice little chunk out of my uh, middle finger there on the right hand. So I started bleeding, and yeah, it's uh, <clears throat> wrapped up. My wife was able to take care of me and, and put an antibiotic on it. And, uh, you know, hey, listen, it happens. What are you going to do? It has been a rocky, rocky couple weeks for me. Um, I'm telling you, it's, uh, it just feels like it doesn't stop. But I have good news. Um, Ariel slept through the night uh, pretty much, and uh, I had a lot of nice sleep, good seven hours of sleep. They always say that you can try to catch up on sleep. You really don't catch up on sleep. You just have a good night of sleep. So I feel better. And uh, today's Friday. The weekend's here. I'll be spending my weekend with my daughter. And finally getting a a couple days of rest. So what's today's episode all about? Well, it's quite simple. It's an open forum. And um, it goes like this. I'm just going to go like I normally do off the cuff. But I don't even have anything, quite honestly, anything that I led into, nothing at all. So I'm going to start with a quick prayer and then just see where the prayer leads me. Heavenly Father, thank you for today's episode. Lord, I came in with nothing in mind. Um, Everything that I did have uh, or even contemplate on uh, just left my mind completely uh, after Cody accidentally took a chunk out of my middle finger. So I want to just thank you, Lord, for keeping me safe, keeping my finger, uh, you know, healthy. And uh, I thank every single person that continues to listen to this show. And, uh, and I hope that all everyone gets to work safely. And we pray this unto you in the name of the Father, Son, and Holy Spirit. Amen. Okay, so it just came to me. This morning, I was able to listen to an announcement made by the Pat McAfee Show, and it was a very inspiring uh, announcement. Uh, they have been picked up uh, by an organization, and I don't have permission to say their name, so I'm not going to, but they have been picked up to a three-year uh, deal, four years, three-year option, um, and this is a show that has been going on with uh, very close friends of his since elementary school. And uh, they dedicated themselves to be uh, who they are, and they have come a long way. How do I know Pat McAfee? I don't personally know him, but I'm a big wrestling fan, and he is the voice of one of the voices of SmackDown on Friday nights. But he inspired me with his announcement today, because he inspired me to know that if you believe in something, 
If you have a dream, if you have a wish, you always plug along. And I've always felt that way with the show, no matter what. My goal has never been to be famous. My goal has never been uh, to try to make money off of this show. It has always been to try to give back to my community, to give back to my high schools, to give um, uh, a foundation and a scholarship program to all children in need. And, um, and to do that you know, through all of you on this platform. So with that being said, Have Faith Let It Begin wants to congratulate the Pat, Mac- Pat McAfee Show and to wish them nothing but the very best. And they, they continue to strive and to do well. And uh, we wish them nothing but the very best. So that brings me up to today's point. <clears throat> all of us have dreams. All of us have wishes. All of us have ideas. And all of us want to see ourselves uh, do well in the world. And uh, many of us lack uh, the ability to be who we want to be because we don't believe in ourselves. We don't allow ourselves the opportunity to know that we're good enough, that we can do it that no one can tell us we can't do it. My entire life, I've always been told that I would never be um, involved anywhere with wrestling, with professional wrestling. And in 1994, I was able to go up and announce my very first ever ring announcing, uh, announcing King Kong Bundy um, against Gary Scott in the Mid-Hudson Civic Center, which aired on Superstars of Wrestling on December 25th, 1994. Somebody told me that I would never, ever ring announce again, and I was able to ring announce for a local OVW uh, club in New Jersey, and that was awesome. Somebody believed in me, and I was able to do it. I've always wanted to be a, some type of an announcer. I've always wanted to preach, and over the years, I've gotten to do every single thing that I set my mind to, especially for those that say that I could never have done it. So I believe in myself. I believe in Half Faith Let It Begin. I believe in each and every one of you, and for that, I say I'm thankful, and I'm grateful, and I am so honored that each and every one of you um, are able to push play every single morning at 7.30 because you believe in this show. So a big shout-out to Pat Mac- McAfee for reminding me that you know this mission is important, and uh, this goal is important, and that I will continue to press along, um, and uh, also to another person of mine, a very good friend of mine who always, always tells me that I do a great job. Uh, you know, Dr. Tommy and Ellie, the host of the Croc podcast, we're partners and, and he always gives me very good insight as to everything that's going on. My best friend, Brian, uh, you know, my friend, Ashley, they, they're always letting me know how much they love the episodes. My aunt Madeline, my good friend, Dylan, who was a, a colleague and somebody I worked with, um, you know, we worked this together as a team, and um, and for all those like Carol Garcia, uh, you know, that just continued to give me messages to Tony, to Joe, with constant feedback to Mansa, you know, to my pastor Jim, who always gives me a thumbs up, and um, we're gonna keep pressing along, guys. And um, I'm just grateful and honored that each and every one of you will continue to help us. Also, good shout outs to a good friend of mine, named Heather, who recently came back into the picture and has also told me how much she loves the episodes. Um, and, uh, you know, I, I love it. I really do. So that's how we're going to end today's episode and, today's, and, and conclude the week here at Have Faith, Let It Begin. Reminding all of you to just believe in yourself, to um, never allow yourself to think that just because you've had a rough patch like I have, whether your car breaking down or uh, bills are piling up, no matter what happens, just take a deep breath, blow it out, and always remember that God is with you, that God believes in you, that God trusts you, and that God will never leave your side. Finally, I want to thank my two greatest supporters of all time, my parents, my dad, Angel, my wife, my wife, my mom, Lucy, uh, for always being my number one fans and for always telling me that I can do all things through God. Thank you so much. I love you guys. And may God be with all of you. May he shine his light upon you. May he grant his face upon you and shine through you so that you can shine through others and grant each and every one of you peace on earth. May God be with you. Merry Christmas, and I'll talk to you again on Monday. Never forget, 
this Christmas Eve and Christmas Day, the Candy Cane Story is back. And you can do it here and only watch it here on Have Faith, Let It Begin. Have faith, let it begin. Thank you for listening to another episode of Have Faith, Let It Begin. That's right, Ariel. We're done with another show. And it's always great to have this show with you, my love. You know, we're going to encourage each and every person to listen to our show every single weekday. That's right. You and I are going to help change the world. Do you think that you can do that for me? Huh? Yeah, you know you can. She does. We want to let you know. and Yes, we encourage you to listen to our show each and every weekday. And it's going to be live at 730. Make sure you're subscribed to our show. Make sure you get ready. Fasten those seatbelts because Ariel and I and my family are going to bring you a new topic, a new story each and every day, right? Isn't that right, Ariel? Yeah. And we impre- <laughs> She's smiling at me. Guys, enjoy your day. Thank you.